Neil Squire was a University of Victoria student who broke his neck in a very minor car accident. Really impossible to explain to anybody how you feel when you're trapped in a body that doesn't work and your head's just going 100 miles an hour. The Neil Squire Foundation. They're involved extensively with computer training, workshop, support services, research and development, and much more. The Neil Squire Foundation has developed sophisticated technological advances that has given many a new lease on life. The Neil Squire Foundation in Vancouver is giving new freedom to a small group of severely handicapped British Columbians. Seventeen-year-old Gordon McDowell has cerebral palsy, and up until he was introduced to the computer, communicating was difficult. But through a program established by the Neil Squire Foundation in Vancouver, Gordon at the Frank Eliason Center in Saskatoon and others across Canada are now reaching a world which before was almost beyond grasp. What we're really trying to do is to give the severely disabled person an equal opportunity to somebody who isn't disabled to our education system, our job training system, to jobs in the community, to give them a level playing field so they can go out and compete with other people in society. It's tremendously rewarding. Yeah, there's a real sense of empowerment from it. A lot of people come to the Neil Squire Society, they're broken, not believing themselves. Sometimes coming to us is the hardest first step, but once they're willing to accept that they want to make change in their life and start investing in themselves, the opportunities are endless. They make you feel like you've done something, you've accomplished something, and something positive. The best that came out of it is that I've learned to get help, and that's something that I never would take before. The technological advances that have been made over the last few years is incredible. But that in itself is not enough. The Foundation believes that people must be recognized for their ability, not their disability. The Neil Squire thing made you feel like somebody. Made you feel like somebody important. Through this program, I count me. I think one of the important things that the Foundation tries always to keep in mind is said beautifully by a poem that was written by a 20-year-old quadriplegic who says that we must always remember our final goal, which is that the life that has been saved must become worth living.